Good morning, everybody. It's time for another Righteous Run. I am Dwayne Davis, also known as Pastor Dwayne F. Davis Sr. of the New Morning Star Missionary Baptist Church on the west side of Chicago, also known as affectionately PD. If I were at a white church, they'd call me Pastor Dwayne. Anyway, I think tomorrow I'll skip all of that introduction and get straight to the point. But the basis of, for this walk is Proverbs 18, verse 10. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run into it and are saved. So here we are as righteous people that have come to know God through his son, Jesus Christ. And it's to you that I give these little walks and talks. I did a three mile run this morning. Now I'm cooling down. Just want to share a few things with you real briefly. Well, first of all, the purpose of this Righteous Run video is to encourage your heart, enlighten your mind, empower your faith, but then to also embolden you to live the kind of life that God wants you to live in this world. This morning, I wanna to talk to all the single people, whether you're never married, divorced, widowed, whatever the case may be, I want to remind you all that you are God's special ops in the church. You are the special operation that God has pulled together a fleet of people who are not tied to relationships, but have more free time, more free money, extra energy to do things concerning God's kingdom. Now, 1 Corinthians chapter 7, verse 32, talks about the single man. It says the single man is concerned about the affairs of the Lord and how he may please him. Then in verse 34, it says that the single woman, she's devoted to the Lord and how she may please him in both body and in spirit. So single people, God expects you to be 100% devoted to him as you are single. I know there's a lot of things you can get involved in, in this life and in this world, but your number one priority is to see what pleases God on a daily basis. I am a Star Wars fan, and there's one scene in the Star Wars movie that I love to play, and it's when Darth Vader goes into the presence of the Emperor, and he bows down, and he does that, what is thy bidding, master? You know, every day when you get up and you pray, you read God's word as a single person, you need to ask them that. What is thy bidding, master? God has a purpose for you today, and he wants you to live that purpose out. But you can't do that if you're not committed to him. You can't do that if you're distracted by this world. You can't do that if you're living in sin. So you got to clean yourself up by the blood of Christ, get back into good fellowship with God and walk with him. And for those of you who are walking with him, continue to be the light in this darkened world. Single people, get involved in causes and so on and so forth, but make sure you never neglect your number one cause, and that is sharing the gospel with some lost soul so that they may find Jesus Christ and be made righteous and fit for heaven. That's the only way God would allow anybody into heaven. Only the pure in heart, the Bible says, shall see God, and Jesus is the purifier. Well, my time is up. Talk to you all later on another Righteous Run.